that they've been offered vein surgery for varicose veins, but they're worried because they're old. And apart from surgery, what else can I do if my legs are feeling tired and aching? Well, well, I would say don't be scared because you're old, actually. I mean, I think, you know, there are things that you can do. Um, but really, the modern treatment that we've got is really very, very low risk, even for older patients. As I've already mentioned, I've just mentioned compression hosiery. It is, you know, it, it that that will control your symptoms that can help control your symptoms uh, along with getting out and about I mean it, I don't like the term old I like the term mature so even if you are mature there is absolutely no reason why you shouldn't get more active gradually get more active keep your legs up when you lie you know when when you're sitting down ideally above the level of your heart but move regularly don't spend too long with your legs down sitting very very important don't spend too long standing but actually in my experience more mature patients the bigger issue is not that they're spending too much time standing it's that they're spending too much time sitting with their legs down but please do remember as i say don't be scared do talk to your gp you can get a referral and then you can talk to them about the options that are available for surgery because as i say the majority of the options that are available we gosh i still remember the days i am old enough to remember the days i'm sure leanne isn't but i remember the days when the standard treatment was basically to rip the veins out under anesthetic and it was just it was oh it was barbaric it's really very virtually never offered these days and, and I am old enough just to, to remember <laughs> that. Offered me varicose vein surgery, I would not say I'd be running out the door. If anybody offered me the newer types of procedure in terms of the minimally invasive, it's a walking, walkout procedure. We've had yeah. people go back to work the same afternoon. Age doesn't truly make a difference. I would say it's really about the severity of your symptoms and the benefits to you. And that's what needs to be balanced in your risk not specifically how mature you are. And I think that's a really good point, that don't be scared of going because you may feel more mature. That doesn't make any difference whatsoever. Everybody should go and get advice. 